Ready? Senior interview. Ow. I just feel like senior interview. Senior interview. Take one. You know, I decided to, to come to Kennesaw State because, you know, they, they made me, coaches made me feel really special. It seemed like a great place. You know, they offered me out of high school. I committed, but wound up not coming. So when they offered me again, it was just like, I got to take advantage of the opportunity. I mean, trying out was honestly super hard. I honestly didn't think I was going to make it. Brand new program. I wanted to see what it was about. Take me on a new lead in life. I was wanting to do anything to help them win championship. You know, we always talked about championships even when I first got here. Being the start of something new, like being able to turn around and be like, I was one of the first people to really start that. I think it's uh, what makes Kennesaw State so special is probably just the group of people we have around here and the culture that's been built over the past couple of years. One of my favorite memories was back in 2016. I helped lead the team to a win against Duquesne. I was not expecting to come in. Win against Wofford was probably my favorite memory here. Spaces are open down the middle. Here comes the blitz. Newman gets away. And he is dropped. Just being being able to go out there and compete like that. My favorite memory here, um, it has to be the Jacksonville State game. Being at the stadium and seeing all the fans and the whole experience, the locker room and, and everything, I think that was my, my favorite memory. Jacksonville State game, you know, it was a good game. We went five overtimes. It was a, a bathroom and a dugout. You know, me and D-Walk, we ran to the bathroom. You know, we ended up peeing. Then they were calling our names, telling us we gotta go back out there because it's another overtime. My favorite memory here, probably when we won the first conference championship. And then we made our playoff appearances both, you know, 2017-2018 seasons in a row. Funny moments probably be in the locker room at the practice, I'm saying. Them boys going on a little dance show. Not, not too many people get to see the dance show. One of my favorite memories um, while being here will be, you know, the relationships I have made with each and every one of the players and coaches here. When we had went to Montana State and we had that snowball fight. Every single coach had like a different impact, you know, Coach Bo, he keeps me Headstrong, Coach Buchanan, you know, his teaching tactics are amazing. Coach Glanton for sure has shaped me to be a better man. Just the way he carries himself. He's a person, you know, that doesn't cuss or anything like that. He still gets his point across, which is something that you learn to respect. I'll say Lydia. Lydia works at our front desk here. She has helped me do, you know, a lot of things. Just the, the things kind of on the outside of football. Well, I see you, them, them tough questions right there I got to think about. The guys around me I'm going to miss the most. Coaches I'm going to miss. I, I miss the team a lot. I miss all my brothers that I uh, made during my five years here. I'm going to be proud of all the things we accomplished here. I'm very proud that I got to represent this great university. <laughs> I, uh... Knowing what I know now, um, I wouldn't change a thing, man. I wouldn't change a thing. It's a great place.